Hi everyone, and I'm Shani. Welcome to Yum's Cuisine Island Treasure Hunt. If you enjoy different dishes from different cultures, ethnicities, and countries, then this channel is for you. What I would like for you to do is hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you'll be the first to see each and every time I'm uploading. So before we get into the video, did you guys miss me? Hmm. If not, I missed myself. Yes guys, I missed myself. So today we are going to be making carbonara. And carbonara is a traditional Italian dish. But today we're going to give it some Caribbean flavors. We're going to spice it up a bit, jazz it up a bit. Yes, guys. So let me give you all an up close and our ingredients for today. So here we have some shadow benny, celery, pimento, sweet pepper, garlic. And moving down, we have here some mushrooms, onion, our star of this dish, bacon, two egg yolks, moving down again, we have here some complete seasoning, the perfect seasoning. We have here some Bertie pepper sauce and guys if you haven't tried Bertie pepper sauce now is the time to do so as well as little me pepper sauce they are both great choices I have here some cooking cream some black pepper olive oil I have here some Parmesan cheese some cheddar cheese some butter rosemary oregano parsley chili powder Italian seasoning and garlic powder and these are going to be the ingredients that we are going to be using today for our dish so our next step oh and spaghetti of course I'm gonna grab that quick so I'm at this stove and my water is already to a boil I added one teaspoon salt and now I'm adding some oil to prevent my spaghetti from sticking to each other I'm just going to leave them here until they slip right into the pot. As you can see, everything is now in the pot. So I'm going to set this aside to finish cooking. So to my hot pot, I'm adding some olive oil while my spaghetti is boiling on the next burner. To this, I'm adding my bacon and you want to ensure that your bacon is well cooked. So while the spaghetti is boiling, we are going to start the dish. To this, I'm going to add my butter, leaving back one piece. And this butter is going to add so much flavor and it's going to be there to help saute the veggies when I'm ready. I'm adding my onion here as well as my garlic and I'm combining those ingredients into the bacon and the fat. I want to cook those until translucent. So this now I'm adding my sweet pepper and my pimento and guys you can call this a rasta pasta as well but originally I'm making a carbonara but because of the peppers we can say it's rasta pasta. I'm adding my mushrooms and these mushrooms are going to add cream as well as the butter. It's going to be creamy and so good guys it's going to be really good really tasty smooth and creamy I'm gonna let these saute so this I'm adding my Italian seasoning garlic powder chili powder
rosemary and all the ingredients will be in the description box below oregano parsley flakes thyme and yes the italian seasoning has all of this but i like to add extra i'm just going to combine those as well I'm gonna add my seasoning here the perfect seasoning some black pepper and I'm then sorry I'm gonna combine this and guys the aroma mm. so I'm back with my spaghetti and my spaghetti is finished so I'm just gonna let it boil a little bit more Now I'm gonna take off the stove and I'm gonna strain it but I'm gonna keep the water returning to this pot I'm gonna bring it to my front burner and we are gonna continue now these are ready for the spaghetti So here I'm adding my spaghetti. Oops. And using my thongs, I'm gonna combine the meat mixture into the spaghetti. Coating that spaghetti into the mixture evenly. What I'm trying to coat it evenly. And remember you want to be patient in the kitchen you really need to be patient trust me you're gonna get through okay so you want to mix that in well so I'm adding the water remember the water I tell you guys not to throw away we're adding some now to the pasta and that's gonna help me to move the pasta easily in the pots it's gonna have that slip and you want to combine that properly So now I'm adding my Parmesan cheese as well as my cheddar cheese. And now my cooking cream. And again we are going to combine this together. Take your time because it can splash. And if you notice that your pasta is drying out again you can add some of the liquid that remained from the pasta after boiling so I'm adding some here because my pasta was drying out a bit now I'm gonna combine that you see how creamy that is guys look at how creamy that is you determine how creamy you want yours I'm adding my egg yolks here sorry and you want to add this in at low temperature because you don't want the eggs to cook you don't want the eggs to cook you want the eggs to add cream and traditionally carbonara you don't normally add cream you just use the egg yolks to give the creaminess to the pasta but you know me I love to jazz thing up and give it that extra flavor because everything must taste good in this kitchen okay guys so I'm adding some more liquid here 
because I want my pasta a bit more liquidy. So you can add any flavors you like. Here I'm adding my shadow benny and my celery. You add any flavors you like to give it that special touch. And that's what you want. Be creative always. Put the flavors that you enjoy. So I'm adding my Bertie's pepper sauce now. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel as yet, now is the time to do so. Hit that subscribe button. I have so much more great recipes in store for you guys. And of course, I'm going to add my Caribbean play to these recipes. Because you know we Caribbean people. Caribbean people, you know we love flavor. We love spice. Everything must taste good. And in this kitchen, I do just that. Now guys, look at how creamy. Look at how creamy this pasta is. I'm going to add some parsley flakes to my pasta. And guys, this is pasta. And I just love the way parsley makes it look so beautiful. So I'm just going to clean up this plate. Because I need my picks, yes. I need to get these shots so that you guys can see this up close and personal. So, who's hungry? Guys, look at it. Look at this. Yes! Who's hungry? I know your, you guys. I know your mouths are bursting with water right now. You guys have have to try this recipe it's so good so now let me taste and tell you guys how it is until you try it yourselves mm. and guys this pasta is really good this is what pasta should taste like so if you enjoyed this video as much as I have like share comment subscribe tell all your family and friends to come over to Yum's Cuisine island treasure pot because this is the place to be